Tax cuts haven't worked. Maybe minimum wage increases will work. It amazes me that people don't understand that it's a great business thing. We need to put more money in the hands of people who will spend it. The very best thing for business in America, over and over again we've proven this, is a vibrant middle class that grows from the bottom up. When you put money into the hands of low-income workers, they tend to spend 100% of the money they earn. When you put money into the hands of high-income workers, they tend to save and invest. There's a huge number of people who don't have enough money to buy stuff, to pay rent, to eat out, to participate in what we think of as the American economy. The lowest wage earners will spend every dollar they get. So that's always going to recycle through the economy. Raising the minimum wage would actually have a multiplier effect. Those dollars will be put to work many times over, circulating through our economy. People who will spend money and not buying their third house on the beach or their second house in the mountains, people who literally need to buy gasoline and groceries and, and goods and services that our economy needs. The minimum wage will provide the worker with more money to buy more goods and services and to have a better lifestyle and to put more money back in the economy and to feel part of the American fabric and not this outskirt of society who lives in an outer borough, say, of New York City, travels into Manhattan to service the rich person and then has to get on a crowded subway that's late and it's just sucks. It's important that they make enough money to be able to support a family. And currently, that is not the case with the minimum wage. Wages have been flat for almost 20 years. Low-income workers aren't getting any of the benefit of the economic growth that we've seen. It's all going to the high-income earners. Higher minimum wages would alleviate a lot of suffering. People would be able to buy G.I. Joe with the Kung Fu grip for their son at Christmas. Will ennoble our manufacturing industries again. We won't live on consumer credit from bubble to bubble. And we'll all prosper. It's really a basic tenet of society that people who do a full work of 40 hour a week should be entitled to a living wage. They'd be able to buy nice flowers for the dinner table and create memories for the children. But I remember once a week, mom brought home flowers. And they brought home flowers because they had five extra dollars or 25 extra dollars. Our economy depends on making products and selling them to large masses of people. People have to have enough money to live on. The workers will be happier, they'll spend more money, and society will be better off.